And a warm welcome. Our venue for this game is the Emirates Stadium in North London. I'm Derek Ray, joined in the commentary box by Lee Dixon. And looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League coming right up. It's Arsenal up against Crystal Palace. Yeah, thanks, Derek. I'm just hoping we get a nice, quick tempo from the start of this game. Both teams do like to get forward, both positive in their approach in the game. So we should be in for some entertainment. Here are the starters for Arsenal. David Luiz starts alongside Socrates in central defence. And leading the line today is the hard to defend against Pierre Emerick Aubameyang. Well, this is the team Crystal Palace have picked. Fairly conventional 4 5 1 setup. Yeah, that back four will be protected throughout the game with the five midfield players in front of them. Really important that they do support that lone striker when they do have the ball. You have to think, Lee, Pierre Emerick Aubameyang's natural goal scoring presence could make a difference here. Well, three goals in his last three games, Derek, breeds confidence in a player. The defenders will be watching him like a hawk. Not what he was intending, bad pass. No real conviction in the challenge. Camarasa will lead to the goal that puts them ahead. And the referee says corner kick. Well, it can be a hit or a miss when it comes to striking it on the volley. Yeah, you always take a risk when it comes in like that, but he took a chance, he was brave just not his day on that occasion this is Ozil Jaka Lacazette now Bellerin Nicola Pepe and Skull for the cross now just couldn't keep the ball Running with the ball confidently. Untidy in possession. Now Bellerin. Now with Aubameyang. Arsenal finding avenues to attack from. Now what can they do from here? Here, Emerick Aubameyang. Textbook defending inside the box. Jaka. Kieran Tierney. This attack looks highly promising. Ozil. He has plenty of support. Granite Jaka. Hector Bellerin. Another sitting ever deeper. They do pass the ball with authority. It did look on for them, but not to be. A goal has gone in at Old Trafford. Let's get the exact details from Allen. It's the second goal for Manchester United. 22 minutes played, 2-0. Cheers again, Allen. Jacka with it. Oh, nice ball. Lost it. The ball with Jordan, are you? Unable to keep the ball that time. Are you? Can they take the lead? And a goal it is, the opener in this game. Well, keep it tight, that's what both managers would have been insane. But now the opening goal's gone in. Tactics have got to change. The opening goal of the game then. Oh, a perfectly timed pass. And he takes it on. Frantic action from one end to the other. They weren't ahead for long. And this match is level again. Well, just look at the keeper. He thinks he's coming out. Have another look. It's in the back of the net. He's a little bit unlucky. Well, the goal again, albeit from a different angle.
so a level contest 1-1 one, one. Socrates David Luiz Jaka Lacazette Nicola Pepe He's given it away Van Anholt Van Anholt Are you Camarasa a really sumptuous ball. Well, he failed to get it away properly. Arsenal completely controlling possession, but that doesn't lead to goals necessarily. They haven't created enough. Too slow up front, midfield, very average. The coach, he's not happy at all. He wants more from this team. Luka Milivojevic. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. Well, they seem to be onto something positive, but it faded away. Well, he's given it away. The referee correctly decided to play advantage. It is to be a throw-in. Very good use of advantage there by the official, letting the play carry on, and then only subsequently handing out the yellow card. Yeah, absolutely, and that's what the fans want. They want to see the game going on. They don't want to see it stopped for something like that. You can always go back and book the player later. Jacker with it. Tierney. Ozil. Lacazette. Can they switch to an even higher gear? Patient enough build up. Can they carve out a chance? It's with Milivojevic. Townsend. The electronic board has been held aloft. Two additional minutes here. The ball with Jordan, are you? Townsend. Well, it was a risky challenge, but brilliantly executed. Pierre Emerick Aubameyang. And there it is, the half time whistle. And so the second half gets underway. Almost a case of the two teams saying to each other, whatever you can do, I can do just as well. Arsenal will have to throw it back in play. Wenduzi. Now Lacazette. Nelson, Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang, looking for that final pass, looking for the goal that would put them ahead, it needs an accurate cross, Matteo Guendouzi, well a long range effort but into the goalkeeper's midriff, yeah the hardest thing is picking the flight up, once he's done that it's pretty simple, and news of a goal in the Manchester United match, Alan McAnally will fill us in, it's a third goal for Manchester United, 49 minutes played, 3-0. Regular updates from Alan McAnally along the way. Oh, they've lost it. Nicola Pepe. This is Ozil. I think most fans would be pretty happy with this man's display so far. Well, he stepped up to the plate to get that goal to put his team on equal terms. Can he produce a winner in this second? Happy to take on the shot. Can they take the lead here? And he's made it a brace for himself. The defender's just unable to stay with him. And he's having a field day. 
Well, it's good play. Ian Wright always told me, stand in the middle of the goal. It sounds simple, but you don't have to get a lot of goals from that position. Well, let's go back to the goal that was scored. Well, it can be difficult being a manager at times, none more so than now. And underway again, Arsenal on the side in front. Luka Milivojevic. And Anholt. What a vital intervention. Deflected behind, corner forthcoming. And firing it into the area. And Anholt. Are you? Big chance to get them on terms. It looked as though he might have been onside, but he was just a fraction off. Oh, I'm not so sure. I'd like to see that again. Hector Bellerin. And a friendly reminder that we have more action from the Premier League coming up. It's Arsenal facing Wolverhampton Wanderers. Yeah, it's very easy to build a case for those two teams. Has a go. Staunch rear guard action. Matteo Guendouzi. Ozil. Excellent challenge. Well, make sure you join us for more Premier League action coming your way. It's Crystal Palace taking on Leicester City. Yeah, the fix is coming thick and fast. Should be a good game, that. Though well, hopefully that's not the commentator's curse. Coming off the pitch. They've decided that now is the time to go to the bench. To be replaced by... Nelson. Wilfred Zaha. Nicola Pepe. Ozil. Lacazette. But he has just veered into an offside position this time. They will now make use of the substitutes bench. Well, it's come down to the final 20 minutes here. Clear foul play, and as a result, a free kick forthcoming. Now with Aubameyang. Nelson. Lacazette here. Crossing possibilities. You need your defender to take charge. Well, body in the way. A bit sloppy in possession. It's with Van Anholt. Into the advanced position. Well, the cross goes in, but there's no one available to snap onto it. Receiving news of a goal in the United match, Alan McAnally. It's another goal for Manchester United. 76 minutes played, 5 0. Thanks, Alan. Over the touchline for a throw in. For Crystal Palace. Well, they've been the getting pitch. the substitute ready, Coming and now the they will make the Jack personnel Jack. change. Coming onto the pitch. Schlup. It's with Van Anholt. Luka Milivojevic. It's with Kamarasa. It's with Milivojevic. And they're moving the ball neatly enough. Just looking for that decisive pass. It was a fine-looking attack, but now they've given the ball away. Well, Arsenal have worked their socks off to get in front today. They really have. The fans have played their part too. Not long to go now. Couldn't hang on to it. Townsend. It's with Milivojevic. And pushed onto the woodwork.
Nicola Pepe. And five minutes to go. Van Aanholt is with Milivojevic. Good technique displayed. Van Aanholt, will he play it in? Superb block on the back of the ball from the flank. Now Lacazette. Nicola Pepe. Arsenal finding avenues to attack from. Now what can they do from here? Well, he made that interception look routine. In truth, it wasn't. And three minutes will be added on for stoppages. Van Aanholt. Substitution time it is. Tompkins has it. Maya. Kuyate now. On the ball in an attacking position, but they've got to do something positive quickly. Kuyate. And there goes the final whistle.